So, where do we park at? Home. Home. We parked on the other side of the water, other side of the world. We literally are walking through the parking lot right now because, well, because this place is so busy for what? What's the act right now for food and food and wine? Hunter Hayes. Hunter Hayes. I don't know who Hunter Hayes is, but he's got a big following, and this place is packed. So we're gonna go and do some more food and wine, but. We're also gonna go ahead and point out what we refer to as our five hidden gems of Bush Gardens. These are places that we like to go and hang out, see some scenes, because it's really, really cool stuff. So we're gonna go ahead and take a look at that now. Oh, you said you had to run the potty ride. Yes, I do. That's what I feel like. Oh, look at that. A cooling towel. How much is it? Oh, it is. The balcony? No, that's the restaurant. Oh. That's where we go. You're welcome. Well, they're really white teeth. Ew, their palm looks really green. That one don't care. None of them care. Oh my god, they're so good. Like they kind of went over and just like laid on one. Okay, kind of big spot like on top of its head. Do you think it'd just be like whatever? I kind of think it would be. Like yeah. That. How do they know when they're dead? <laughs> what, what did you ask, just ask? What was the question? How do they know when they're dead? Because they all look dead. Like they wake up one day, they come to work. Like they, nothing's normal. They, ch they check for proof of life when, um, when basically, when they feed them. That's when they check for proof of life. Right. about this place is that you've got the roller coasters that you can look at um, but more than anything else you just have this Serengeti view that you can see the, the drafts getting fed by the people and it's just very calm and relaxing. Now we're here on probably the busiest day. This is hands down probably the busiest day we've been this here. Is right? day. Yeah. So like usually there's less people out here um, but it is a very cool relaxed I'm gonna get yourself a nice big beer. It was a nice place to relax, especially if you've been on a couple of roller coasters and you're hot and sweaty. And you want a little shade and you want something calm to, to, to um, calm down and enjoy the environment.
Once again, this is probably the busiest day we've been in the Bush Gardens. And we're going to show you Hidden Gem number two, which generally is a very nice and calming place because you have a bench that you can sit at. So you can take a seat at the bench and you can watch the hippo float around in the water. This is very relaxing because you can kind of sit here, chill, enjoy your beverage, wash the fish and the hippos, just swim back and forth. So if you can see the hippo in the background, he just swims back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. What's your thoughts on the hippo? He's a hippo. This is like being a big fish bowl, isn't it? Now this is the third hidden gem of Bush Gardens. There's another place that you would want to go and just hang out. And there's a couple of them. Is there a couple? Yeah, there's two right here. They're all snuggled oh, up against each other. There used to be a ton of them, though. Where are they? And they're, they're probably in the shade. <laughs> they're just sleeping. And this one guy is like, he's haphazardly looking out. He's not, he doesn't look like he's really in it to win it because usually they get up real up in the high lengths. I think there's another one down here. Also, is that a cauliflower? So up here, is where that Serengeti overlook is it, where it used to be called the Crown Colony. And what you can see, but you really can't see with the, with the camera, is the giraffes and the giraffe feeding. What's really cool about Bush Gardens is that it is a zoo. You have pretty much every animal that you can think of that's in a zoo. And then on top of it, you're surrounded by roller coasters. I do want to let you know that this is not a hidden gem. It's my hidden gem. She loves it, but it's not a hidden gem because people pass this. No, it doesn't smell like a gem either. You can smell the elephants when you walk through this area. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's not the big, spike. The big one is the boy, right? Is that spike? Spike is big, and it's... They're, she bought the biggest of, of the four. The great elephant. Yeah, but I don't know if it's... The elephant. Name, always, name another elephant's name here that you know. You don't know. I don't know. What are the elephant's names? Rosie. Yeah. Okay. That's all I know. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I thought you were going to name all five. I knew 100% more than you. <laughs> she got me there. Anything else? I don't know if that's Spike or not. Spike is like a not. Who's that? Spike. Why? Tusks. See the tusks? That's Spike. Okay. He's got tusks. He's like... Oh! <laughs> Ooh. 
Well, that's a good one. You're gonna like that. Is she gonna grab it? Is she gonna, she grab, gonna it? grab it? Look at this. <laughs> Yo, <ooh. laughs> You're right, I was thinking face. Oh my gosh! Oh, how cute! Oh, oh my gosh! Right. <laughs> Is she gonna grab it? It's Palm Saturday. That's not easy. That's not easy to do. <laughs> that would be the worst. I would never be that. You have to. You know what you're gonna have to do? You gotta spin like a shot putter. You gotta. We go with. We just do the push. You do the push, yeah. I'm starting to think maybe I can make it. I can make that one somehow. Oh, the wind. There you oh, go, yeah! Nice oh, here's a good one. That's a good one. That's oh, a good one. Spike. Get a spike. Oh, he's like. Oh, no one wants that? That looks good. I would take that. Okay, I'm, go I'm going. Oh, get it! Oh, that's so sweet! Love it. Oh, Spike, you get yours! Karina. 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 You don't know. You don't know. But she's long enough. No, you One of my favorite areas right here because of this uh, this border sport thing for the Congo River ride. It is the most entertaining thing. The only thing that are missing in this immediate area would be like a beer stand. They put a beer stand that can make a chilling. I don't know why they don't do that, but it's phenomenal. So I love that. I love it. It's my, my one of my favorite little areas here at Bush Gardens. And it's a hidden little gem. You got all the excitement. You got the water. You got the roller coaster. This fun little place that I love so much. All right, so we're coming up on um, one of our little hidden gems over here, and this is a place that you can easily pass if you take a right instead of a left. And it's walkabout, and it's walkabout way. 
which is a little kangaroo um, area. That you can take a look at kangaroos. But what's so cool, cool about this little ale or area is this little sanctuary that we got going on with the waterfall. And you can see the big topper area that's just from the uh, Food and Wine Festival. This guy's floppy. Oh my god, that was so floppy. That's the Leo. Okay, this is a whole lot. This is a whole lot. They're all impressed. Look at how small this is. Look at this woman. They sleep like cats. They're just like floppy. Ooh, I like that breeze. This is a hidden gem. I love flamingos. There's more here than at SeaWorld. Oh, look at those sleepy ducks. And sleepy ducks. But it's all full of flamingos. I came here to look at flamingos and chew bubblegum. And I'm all out of bubblegum. And little ducks back there. Aww. What? Are they having a disagreement? Oh, oh yeah. mm, yum yum. Oh yeah. Delicious. Did they really find lettuce on For the record, this is not a hidden gem. You don't know. She likes it. It's not a hidden gem. He's eating his lettuce. He likes lettuce. He's like, leaving my lettuce wrap today. Yum, yum. Who's the pretty girl behind you? Me. No, behind you. 
She's a butterfly. She's got a butterfly. She has a butterfly. She's pretty.